Labor market in Malaysia was not closed, said Overseas Employment Minister Nurul Islam BSC. The Anti-Corruption Commission has started quizzing eight officials of Barupukuria coal mine. Three persons, including two drug dealers, were killed in separate shootouts to died in accident in Kumilla. Assalamu alaikum, welcome to my TV news. I'm Farhana, yes, we're with you in the newsroom. Today we're watching headlines, now the details. Expatriate welfare and overseas employment. Minister Nurul Islam BSC say that the labor market in Malaysia was not closed. He said this at a press conference organized by the reporters of Bangladeshi migrant in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs in the morning. He said the necessary steps will be taken against the 10 agency syndicate complaining against the Malaysian government. The minister said women domestic workers returned from Saudi Arabia due to food and language problem. The fast return house flight has reached Dhaka with 419 Malish pilgrims from Saudi Arabia. The flight touched down Hazrat Shah Jala International Airport at 11.12 p.m. on Monday. Chief Executive Officer and Managing Director of Biman Bangladesh Airlines, A.M. Mossadegh Ahmed, Biman's General Manager, Shakil Miraz, among other top officials, conveyed welcome to the pilgrims at the airport. A total of 1,26,798 prospective house pilgrims are scheduled to perform house from Bangladesh. According to Biman authorities, they have taken all necessary preparation from safe return flight of house pilgrims which will continue till September 27th. The Anti-Corruption Commission has started quizzing eight officials of coal mine in a case filed over a huge amount of coal selling in open market from the Barpukuria. SCC Deputy Director Samsul Alam started the interrogation around 9 a.m. on Tuesday. Besides, 17 more officials are scheduled to face SCC investigation on August 29 and 30. On July 24, BCMCL Director General Mohammed Anisu Rahman filed a case with the Parbhuti Police Station in Dinaspur, mentioning 19 names, including former MD Habibuddin Ahmed. Later, the case was later transferred to the SEC for investigation. According to the official investigation, more than 1,42,000 tons of coal is missing from Barpukuria. Three persons, including two suspected drug dealers, were killed in separate shootouts in Natur, Gajipur and Borgona. The shootouts reportedly took place in separate times from Monday night to early hours of Tuesday in Natur. Suspected drug dealer Meher Ali, 35, and accused in 14 cases over murder, robbery and drug dealing, was killed in a reported shootout with the members of Rapid Action Battalion in Chamtia area of Lalpur Upojil around 2.30 a.m. Two rap members sustained injuries in a shootout in Gajipur. An unidentified drug dealer was killed in the reported shootout with a rap one in Tongi Township area around 3 a.m. A man and his four-year-old son were killed as a CNG drive an auto rickshaw hit a tree after losing control on Kumilla. Buri Chang Road at other show Shadur Pojola Tuesday morning. The deceased are Aminul Islam and Wafi Islam Nabil. Aminul's wife and daughter sustained injuries in the accident. Witness say the family were on way to the bus station leaving Brahmapara to catch bus for Dhaka after celebrating Idul Acha. At least three people, including two children, went missing after a trawler carrying 100 passengers capsized in the Jomuna River after a collision with a sand-laden cargo vessel this morning. The identities of missing people could not be known immediately. The trawler left Kajirhat area of Pabna Bera Upojela for Arichaghat in Manikons district in the morning around 
10 a.m. the trawler capsized in the river after hitting the cargo near Alukdia Chor adjacent of Arija Ghat. All the passengers except the three managed to swim ashore. Thanks for being with us to join with my TV news online. Visit www.youtube.com slash news and to watch all our programs on YouTube, visit youtube.com slash mytvbangla. Our next bulletin will be telecast in Bangla at 7.30 p.m. Stay connected. Allah Hafiz.